It is a very good look for a dancer. Bounty Kill and Mavada have finally made peace. After years of this song, tongue lashing in print, broadcast, and social media, the father and son prodigy have made amends. Both Bounty Killer and Movada have seemingly put the past behind them. Bounty Killer made a post on his Instagram expressing his happiness that Movada and himself have reunited. The picture post of both at Bounty Sunday's red. Sorry for all who don't want to see this, folks, but give God all the praise. There ain't nothing he cannot fix. Much love goes out to at Movada Goli for the surprise Father's Night link. It was a great moment at NSC Bounty Sundays last night. Father and son like it were in the beginning. A step of unity is a mile of strength. Tag a friend if you are happy to see this as I am right now. This post sent social media in a frenzy as fans of both artists were excited and expressed their joy and support and endorsement for the show of unity by both artists. It is good to see this beef or conflict take a 180 degree turnaround because it had become so bitter and had the potential to escalate into major violence. Thanks to the respect that both had for each other's street credibility, the borders were set and neither breach or cross that line. For those of us who are new and might not know about this conflict or might have forgotten, here are sample diss songs and video interviews done by both. It is intended to catch you up to speed on what happened and not to put a negative spin on a positive moment. <laughs> You had the man. What kind of man must he be in farmer one? Your artist them go embassy, said them no fee get no visa. You can go and go marry to Uncle Sam. Boost you all, while I drop the bomb. In a gully, blood me ready if you wash me hand. Cry like a bitch, swim like a fish. You say you're rich, but listen, this a killer. Make you all your first 20 grand. Killer, I've been walking around and calling my name to people all the time. Okay. And try trying to style me behind my back. And if him see me in a, in a, in a, in a street, him give me the biggest a smile. Say, yo, yeah, 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 the biggest a smile. And behind my back. So the songs didn't surprise and, and you? No, it didn't surprise me. The no, I don't know the status right now. I hear in a lot of things, I heard song came out, people say a bounty, my father do it for. I sing a song named, help the youth them stop beg the 20 and the 50 them. And when the marga like skeleton, I run down my van, say them begging grand. I hear people saying his mother had me attack. I'm talking about all these kids that came around and forget what I've done for them. Okay. If it matches Movada, it matches Busy, or it would have matched Elephant, anyone as well. Mm. This was a very good move, especially for Movada, who some dancehall fans viewed as being ungrateful for this and the person that brought him into the game, in which made him famous, successful and rich. Sometimes you have to swallow your pride, plus this was a good damage control if there was need for one. I however think that Movada was misunderstood and people must understand that two bull cannot roll in one pen. Bounty is a natural leader and Mavada is also a natural leader. And heads will clash when two strong personalities with big ego have difference of opinions. I think that Mavada will feel like he has the weight of the world off his shoulder because he knew deep within that Bounty Killer paved the way and made his success a little more smoother. Not saying that he would not have made it eventually based on his talent, but we cannot deny that Bounty Killer placed a spotlight and highlight on him that sped up the process. Bounty Killer should always be respected by everyone in Dancer. Does he have faults? Yes, he does. He's cross, miserable, and angry at times. But when we weigh the pros versus the cons, he has done more for dancehall than anyone else. His heart is in a good place, and no man is perfect. Bounty Killer introduced the world to Movada, Vibes Cartel, Elephant Man, Scare Them Crew, Kaleida, Wayne Marshall, etc., etc. Vibes Cartel in turn introduced the world to Popcorn, Black Rhino, Tommy Lee, etc., etc. Those artists have had a major influence in the dancehall landscape in the past decade up to this date. It is obvious that Bounty Killer is getting older and wiser and he is more willing to humble himself and put the welfare of Dancehall in front of his own personal agenda and he should be hailed and commended for his selfless acts. This is a positive look for Dancehall and even though we all like lyrical clashes, these two were not really having lyrical clashes. It was more like bitter bashing going back and forth and there were no positive. Now that they have reunited, we have some hope of collaborations and good classic stage performances that is too often missing these days. We must all remember that this feud was very deep and escalated when Mavada severed ties with Bounty Killer following a shooting incident at Bounty Killer's party at Quad Night Club in Kingston, Jamaica in 2011 where a member of Mavada's crew was killed by a policeman. What made it even worse was that Mavada saw Bounty Killer as a traitor for keeping his birthday party at Quad Night Club that was owned by Corritat who was then manager of Vice Cartel. 
All of this was happening during the Gully and Gaza war between Movada and Vice Cartel. With all of this, it seems as if they've decided to bury all feelings and grievances officially. And Movada and DJ Khalid have responded to Bounty Killer's Instagram post. Movada posted a photo of himself and Bounty Killer with the caption, Bosses. DJ Khalid also responded to Bounty Killer's post with the caption, I love to see Jamaica blessing. The next big blessing is for an anthem with Bounty Killer and Movado. People, please let me know what you think about this move in the comment section. Who do you think was wrong? Do you think that they both should be held accountable for making this get out of hand for too long? Is it a good look to see two giants in dancers settling their differences? Thanks once again for checking out my video. It is greatly appreciated. Please check out the website link in my profile banner. Please like, comment and subscribe. Bless up. One love.